All right, hey everyone. I just wanted to do a quick little apartment tour since I never really did one of those and I had talked about doing one. So I wanted to take you all on a little trip through my now clean apartment since I did a little bit of spring cleaning today. So we're just at the front door. Front door, not like it's that big of an apartment. Um, so yeah, right when you walk in, I have my shoe tower. Nothing exciting. I have a little closet right there that just has like all my coats and vests and luggage and all that in it. When you walk in, it's just right to my bathroom. Again, nice and cute. All the tiling's actually really nice in my bathroom. I quite like it. Well, vanity. I hate this overhead light, so I put a lamp up there because I'm ghetto. So, um, yeah, it's my bathroom. And then this is kind of little entryway. I have my little um, key rack with all my sunglasses and my wallet and keys over there. And then I finally just hung most of this stuff on the wall today because I've been so lacking and lazy. But I have my Cindy Lauper record and my um, chorus line record. Um, a Pink Floyd record and I don't kill me for that not being in a sleeve there wasn't one and it's already really scratched anyway so don't scream at me um I have my Joan Jet up there which my friend Jim um, Papa Constantine took that photo so um, as most of you know I love Joan Jet so I have that up there all my inspiring women as I walk in and out of my apartment every day um, I have my graduation tassel, my lovely poop brown BFA musical theater tassel, which is hanging there because I don't have anywhere else to put it really. Um, I have my little Ikea cube with my diffuser going right next to my printer with my lovely little like vine sculpture that one of the Sermont brothers made me back in high school. I don't remember which one of you made it, but um, it's beautiful and it's been in every room I've lived in since I got it. So, um, yeah. Then my kitchen, my kitchen is right here. Don't laugh at my blunders on the ground. I just cleaned it, so I haven't put it back in the cupboard yet. My refrigerator with all my fun little magnets and quotes. And then my microwave and my snacks. Not exciting. Um... This is, I'll try to give you like a full view of my box that I live in. Um, yeah, that's like it. I have my nice little couch over here. Um, this pulls out into a twin bed, which is cool. Um, so if you ever come visit, that's what you're sleeping on. Uh, um, my Iron Man slash Avengers blanket. Um, my little, my little coffee table. Um, my entertainment center with my TV that is much too small for said entertainment center. Um, that houses all of my DVDs, books, plays, textbooks, and playbills, um, since I've moved here. Um, and then all of my scores, and these are all stacked double, double deep, um, scores, scripts, anthologies, all that. Um, and then back down there is just like more storage for cleaning supplies, more music, binders, random stuff. Um, my TV again that I've literally had since college. Um, lots of cute decorative stuff up here. Um, my butterfly jar, my sea glass collection, my beautiful lucky bamboo that Sherry just sent me, which I love. Um, just some more stuff up here. My humidifier. Again, nothing horribly exciting. Um, but this is the cool, honestly, like the cool part is my bed, um, which every time I post any pictures or when I did post pictures when I first moved in, everyone like freaked out over my bed, which um, a guy named Sander um, designed with me and um, he runs a company called Bedlofts NYC. Um, if you want his information, let me know, but he custom built this for me. Um, I kind of helped. I told him what I wanted and he brought it to life and I'm in love with it. He built it there the day I moved in. I have a full size bed up there. Um, my bed's not made so I'm not taking you up there. But um, yeah, like pieces of driftwood and it's all like found. Like this is a legit like tree log that I've now obviously wrapped Christmas lights around. 
but yeah, love my bed. It's super great. I have, I always hang my blankets up there just because it's easier. Um, I have just some pictures. I have my pretty odd record um, next to like all my perfume and my jewelry box and my Ikea shelves um, slash chest of drawers. Um, and then of course I have my desk that is my makeup um, station. Um, but most of you have seen this because I've posted pictures of it kind of, but all my palettes, um, my salt lamp, you know, all my makeup stuff. Um, so we're actually underneath my bed right now and the cool, another cool thing about this is like I have, so I have these drapes, right? But actually back here is like all, is like my closet. Basically I have my guitar under there, my laundry, but like when I have people over, rarely, um, you know, or if it's messy, I just kind of like everything to look really cohesive and um, organized. So I usually close this up and it's, I'll show you kind of what it looks like. I don't know, it just, it kind of is a cleaner look to me than seeing into my closet with all my stuff but I mean just something something fun extra that I did um skipper hangs out there as does um my little stuffed animal but um yeah and I just have again more artwork that my sister Kate did I have my pride flag from Boston Pride last year um yeah just my little string lights again I live in an 11 by 10 foot box so I mean there's my my Irish flag again that's the other view of going out by the by the door so that's it y'all that's seven minutes of a very small studio apartment in Manhattan um yeah that's pretty much it um again that's my that's my place um in case anyone was ever wondering what it looked like um now you know and now you've now you've had a little tour, so um, have a good night, and uh, if you have any questions or whatever, um, feel free to uh, shoot me a message. Bye.